They buried Bob Graham today in Westchester County, 97 years old, and he had not one family member to pay their respects, but what a send off he got. Really was an incredible one. The decorated World War II Marine received the kind of military hero's funeral he absolutely deserved. It was packed and all because of one act of incredible kindness by a young woman. A nursing home volunteer who befriended Bob Graham. Here's Iowa News reporter Marcus Solis. Bagpipes and an honor guard. Veterans at attention saluting the flag draped coffin of a decorated former Marine. There's no question this was a hero's farewell in Shrub Oak. He was in the Marine Corps during World War II. He was in the Pacific and he had the Bronze Star and a Silver Star. So, I mean, he was in the thick of it. But not everyone knew Bob Graham, who died earlier this month at the age of 97. Most of the mourners didn't. After his military service, he worked as a corrections officer and was married for 60 years. But when Rosie died a couple of years ago, Graham was essentially alone, no close living relatives. A volunteer at the nursing home where he lived didn't want his passing to go unnoticed, so she organized a fitting tribute. I'm amazed at how many people came out for Bob, but then again, I'm not. I mean, he was such a special person. His life was so incredible, and his story really spoke to so many people's hearts. Bob was there for us in World War II, and he has nobody, and we're his family today. The funeral drew veterans from around the area, as well as strangers who paid their respects. And Regan was honored as well. Three hoorays for Beth! Hip, hip, hooray! Handed the folded flag traditionally given to family members. I'm just overwhelmed with emotion and the support and the outpouring of love is, it's incredible. A moment of recognition for a woman who made sure a life of duty and honor was properly remembered.